Hey guys, it's Brittany with NGN here at Ubisoft. We are checking out Watch Dogs 2. I am here with someone from the team. I'll let him introduce himself. Yeah, I'm uh, Jonathan Morin, I'm the creative director on Watch Dogs 2. Fantastic. I was a huge fan of Watch Dogs, the first one, and I'm excited to know that there's a two coming up. And um, will you tell me and everyone watching a little bit more about the game? Yeah, like in Watch Dogs 2, you play as a little young hacker called Marcus Holloway. Uh, he joined DeathSec, which is a group of hackers who are fighting against the establishment to bring back control because these guys have been using technology in sorts of ways that you know, take away from our freedom in the Bay Area. So we wanted to push for a more rebellious attitude this time around. It is based in San Francisco. Right. And so if I don't know if you guys got to see the trailer. If not, you should. But it's absolutely beautiful and like to go through and you can see the water and the bridge and the art style everything is just gorgeous with the game and I saw that it seems a little familiar like the style of walking around has much changed since Watch Dogs 1 or is the engine and everything similar? Uh, the engine has been is the same engine as in the first game and we continue to push it forward like right with the, the Bay Area we had to be much more strong on the verticality like and we had to double the map to make sure that we have like a large vista and all the stuff that you could find in the in the bay area and have everything at the right place uh, so like we had to push technology quite a bit and i think it shows when we uh, look at the game good fantastic and i saw that you can use a drone that was wonderful that's really cool i feel like that's a theme of three this year it's a lot of uh, games are making use of drones and virtual reality. All right, well, thank you so much for meeting with me today. I know it's a busy day and it's really hectic here, so I'm gonna go on and try to see as much as I can for the rest of the day, and then I hope you have a wonderful rest of your E3. Same for you, and it was a pleasure to talk to you.